guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's hair review time you guys hair review and uh this time i'm going to show you guys how i customize my frontal as well okay so this hair is from wig encounters you guys oh i just fell in love with this hair when i installed it guys when i got this hair i was like i wasn't feeling it that much but as soon as i installed this hair i was like oh my god this hair looks so good on me like can't really tell the beauty of this hair when it's in the package like when it's in the pack but when you install this hair and when you feel this hair you guys this hair is so soft i love this hair. so this hair is from wig encounters okay wig encounters so this hair was sent to me by wig encounters this hair is indian remy hair and the length that i've caught is 22 inch guys 22 inches this hair is a lace front wig it's not a full front like you don't have the lace up to like here so it's just a lace front wig okay so you can only part this long just here so you can only part this long and you cannot really part anywhere because the other places are really short so this is the only longer bit that you got okay my hair with a side part so i don't really need to worry about moving it or padding anyway i love my side part anyways okay but if you want to purchase this wig and you're thinking of padding it anywhere you want it's not gonna work because this is all the bit that's got the long bit so just this bit other places are short okay okay this hair comes in jet black so you cannot dye this hair guys you cannot dye this hair so you only buy this hair in jet black i cannot change the color okay but you can straighten them you can tongue them you can do whatever you do with normal human hair because it's a human hair it's indian raven human hair but you cannot dye them because it's not virgin okay this is just going to show you how i install my lace frontal wigs okay so i'm going to show you in a bit how i installed my lace front tool in case a lot of you have been wondering how i slay this front like mm -hmm. you want to slay your front like my front you want your hair to look realistic you have to stay you have to stay tuned okay i wish i could be able to dye this hair when i want to but overall I love the hair it did shed a little bit when i was combing the hair but just a little bit it can pre plug you guys look it's already plugged you don't need to plug this wig at all look, i love it and uh it's pretty affordable it's like a three to nine dollars so in pounds would be like 250 which is affordable for a front which is affordable for a frontal wig because you don't actually need to Buy the bundle, pay someone to make the wig. It's already made, so it's a wig. Okay, so it's actually affordable, you guys. Yeah. So and uh, the fact that the fact that it's pre-plugged, you don't actually need to kind of customize and the uh, cap itself is bleached, so it can actually you don't actually need to kind of bleach unless if you want a little bit. If you want a little bit more brown you can use powder or foundation okay so this this hair came in this beautiful package it came in a box okay so this is how it came this is how it came in in a box and inside the box is the hair the, inside the box is the wig itself oh look at that wig and then i combed it it feels so good and soft with a little bit of shedding Okay. Glue, it's a glueless wig so you can use the comb that comes with the wig so that will make it stay without you actually gluing it down okay if you want to if you want to use it as a glueless wig you have to use the comb that came with it but in my own case i just want to glue them down so i did not use the comb so i didn't use the comb that came with it i just used an elastic band and i attached this elastic band to it okay so i can use it as i can use it without the i can use it without the comb that it came with then i cut the excess lace that came with it as well before i install my wigs i like to wear a wig cap sides of my hair are shaved because when i over the years when i wear my lace frontal like when i want to glue them or when i even wear wigs at all 
I hate when the sides are natural and then my hair is straight, if that makes sense. So I do like to shave a little bit of the side. Hey. I know I'm not supposed to do that, but yes, that's how I like them. I like them shaved. So when I install my hair, it looks flaky, like so. No natural hair show you. So all my natural hair is inside and protected. Okay, they got to be the gel itself, first of all. Then I use a spray on top, do the temple falls. Okay, the temple falls, then the sides. Okay, so yeah. For the back, you guys, you know when I have my blonde hair as well, I don't normally glue the back of my hair, okay? <laughs> I don't normally glue the back of my hair, but I have this trick that I normally do, you guys. Yeah, so I use a pin. I use a, I use a bobby pin and I kind of pin them on top of the hair. So I bring like a section from the back. So I bring the section out like that and I pin on top of the section. So when I take it up, you know, the wig cap is not gonna show, if that makes sense. So I do that to the sides as well. So bringing a little bit out, then uh, uh, um, bring it a little bit out, pinning it down with a bobby pin. So when you take it up, you're not gonna see no wake cap. Okay, and people are gonna think you glue them down. That's the trick, guys, for the back because I nobody got time to be gluing the back. You know. So I might do an updated video for this week, just in case you guys wanna know how the hair is holding up. Okay, I might do an updated video for this it's actually a good reasonable density you guys because sometimes some lace wigs are so thin like very thin this is not as thin as some lace wig that's gonna look like don't you have enough hair this is actually enough this is actually enough hair you guys so it's good natural wavy mm -hmm. <laughs> so i'm gonna leave it like so i'm not gonna straighten this hair or do anything to this hair and the father is jet black which is good because i have my blonde hair thank you guys for watching in case you're not subscribed to my channel please do subscribe and that just in case you're subscribed and you don't get notifications maybe because you did not turn on notifications so make sure you turn on notification you guys okay so you can get my notifications anytime I upload videos okay